Hello guys, welcome back to HOC Metal Parts. Today we're going to talk about the reduction process called turning. This is a great introduction video, especially for the beginners. So let's not waste more time and let's get straight to it. Turn parts have very good symmetry. Circles, cones and cylinders are among the most common used shapes. These characteristics are achieved because of the high speed rotation of the workpiece. In turning, the tool moves linearly, usually exile or radial, and as it touches the spinning workpiece, a circular cross section is created. Let's move to the production side so we can see the process in detail. Lathe is the special equipment that we use for carrying out this process. With the help of CNC system, we can achieve IT8 to IT7 machining accuracy. Equipped with an automatic feeder, we can reduce labor cost by 70%. Here we go around steel bar, which is our workpiece for today. First, based on the product 3D drawing, engineers will use CAM to convert it into a G-code. These are a series of instructions that are loaded onto the CNC system and control the lathe processing. The choice of tool also depends on the product design. We have a special video episode in which we talk about turning tools. But for now, let's just clamp the tooling cutter in the tool holder. One click start, the materials are pushed into the spindle, tightened and processed one by one. You see the metal being chipped away and the work is gradually processed. After just a few minutes, we can see our fine product. Of course, dimensional inspection is required, so we can make sure our product meets all the design requirements. This was the complete CNC turning process. Follow HOC if you want to know more about our processes and if you can see some more of our projects. See you around folks!